And now you're leaving Digital Forensics to come in and clean up your dirty mess. Well, what is Chad Mason gonna do when? I mean, look, look at what Brad Zymus Hayward, said. Listen, look at what Brad Zymus said. Look, Zymus said yeah. there is audio. I contacted Rob Davis and informed him of my findings, and she shut her book. I, mean, I did what's my the job. Point of, I mean, what's the point of uh, digital forensic follow, go, to protect the integrity of this dash camera and the SD card? She said she mirrored the files on this SD card and then uploaded them. No. Oh, no, 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 no. no, 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 no. Chad Mason is the one that uploaded them. But what's the point of mirror doing a mirror for the files to protect the integrity if you have Chad Mason who already downloaded it? without doing any of that and uploading it to evidence.com. What's the point? What's the point? I, I mean, mean what, shouldn't, shouldn't digital forensics be the one to download these files and upload them? I mean, think, think about upload what Upload the original files th to th evidence.com? Think about what Zymus says. On the stand, she says, and you'll hear this. She says, in my whole entire experience as digital forensic, there is no way that a file could be corrupted halfway. It either has audio or it doesn't have audio. That makes sense.